We've got trouble in paradise. I noticed a few weeks back that the right banana plant in my main clump of Musa Bastus was looking a little ragged. I didn't think much of it because from a distance it looked like maybe the plant wasn't getting enough water and I figured I would adjust the drip line when I had time but wasn't a big issue for the short term. Over the last few days the plant has deteriorated very quickly. Newer leaves look like they've been around for months and are dying. Upon closer inspection, several of the Musa Bastus showed damage. They have black stripes on the stems that extend up the center of the leaves, and the leaves themselves are covered in spots and are drying out. Since we're getting towards the end of summer, I decided to focus on trying to ensure good plants next year and made the decision to start removing any of the plants that show any damage. It's pretty sad cutting down 16 foot tall banana plants in September, but leaving them would risk all of these plants. There's a common leaf spot disease, black cigatoka, but I'm not sure that's what this is, as all of the pictures I can find look different than what I'm seeing on my plants. And in all honesty, I am not an expert on telling the different types of diseases that can infect banana plants. Since there's no way for me to tell exactly what this is, I'm going to treat it like a fungus. Now this part is really hard to do, but when you're cutting down plants, try and avoid leaves touching other things, other banana plants that are healthy or the tools that you're using or anything that's around you. The less disruptive you can be, the less you're going to knock fungal spores that would spread and continue to cause problems. I cut down all the infected plants to within a few inches of the ground. I also cleared up some of the ground cover and bamboo leaves that were hanging out and trimmed the banana plants that remain just to improve the airflow around the plants and try and give them the best chance of survival. With all that done, I'm coating everything in copper fungicide. I went through two bottles uh, in my backyard. For good measure, I sprayed all of the other banana plants that I had back there as well, so everything got sprayed. If it was a banana, it got sprayed with the copper fungicide. I'll keep a close eye on these for the rest of the year, removing any plants that show signs of infection. <laughs> 